Yeah. 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 Y
So now I separate his fringe. I'm gonna isolate it from everything else. Everything else is cut. It's not finished, but it's cut. And I'm just gonna finger raise the fringe. So he wants it sitting like right above his eyebrows. I just changed the blade on this. So, you know, when you got a new blade in that finger razor, it just melts through the hair. Look at it, it's just shredding. And I'm not just like chopping, I'm kind of feathering it, you know. I'm being rough, but it's gonna give it that nice textured look. And I kind of like making the longest point of the fringe right in the middle of his forehead, like near his nose. The part that lines up with the nose, if that makes sense. So the fringe, in my opinion, should come down kind of like a triangle in a way. Right here, I'm just making sure everything's even before I start really layering it. And finger razoring, razoring it while it's also dry, which I do a little bit later, can be good too. So then you're kind of like trimming it in its natural state. So you already see how it's gonna be. You know what I'm saying? So I wanted his uh, fringe shorter a bit. So now I'm gonna dry it and then I'm gonna finger razor everything again. So we're kind of at that Justin Bieber level, that 2009 cut. Now we're gonna kind of make it a modern style. So I'm gonna shave everything under his nape, lifting the hair up under his sideburn, shaving all that so that it gives it a nice clean modern look. And now I'm gonna layer everything on top of that with the finger razor. Give it that messy, not so neat. Cause right now it looks like a bowl. We're gonna make it kind of a rough bowl cut. So I started the guide in the back and now we're gonna follow that guide all the way through. Just kind of on the external perimeter of his hair. So not really the top, kind of that external. I didn't want it over his ears. I wanted it sitting on his ears kind of a bit. And you can see, I'm just in my zone, like, you know, just in my zone. I'm gonna put some matte clay. I put a little bit of sea salt, then we're gonna blow dry that in. And then we're gonna add the kind of that game changing product. This is just the uh, dry texture powder. This is gonna give it that fluffy look. And this is the cut. I mean, I think it came out great. Right here, I'm just gonna detail that. This is a trouble area a lot of times in some of my straight hair haircuts. Kind of that transition zone going from the side panel into the fringe. Make sure that's on point. So this is how my client came in. And this is how he's leaving. Clean. This is different. It's your boy Foreign, I'm out. Peace.